Welcome back to the channel everyone, it's great to see you all here again. Today we're diving deep into the fascinating world of ethical hacking and cybersecurity. This is a field that's constantly evolving, with new threats and defenses emerging every day. In this video we'll be taking a closer look at the top 10 OSINT tools you need to know in 2024. These tools are essential for anyone serious about cybersecurity. We're talking about the software that cybersecurity professionals and ethical hackers use every day to protect systems, gather intelligence, and stay ahead of potential threats. And I'm excited to break it all down for you, MKBHD style. We'll go through each tool, discuss its features, and show you how it can be used effectively. Whether you're just starting out in the field or you're a seasoned pro looking to update your toolkit, this video has something for everyone. So stick around to learn how these powerful tools can up your cybersecurity game. By the end of this video, you'll have a solid understanding of the best OSINT tools available and how to use them to enhance your cybersecurity efforts. We'll also share some tips and tricks from industry experts, giving you insider knowledge that can make a real difference in your work. So grab a notebook, get comfortable, and let's dive into the world of OSINT tools and cybersecurity together. This is going to be an informative and exciting journey. Before we jump into the tools themselves, let's talk about OSINT. OSINT stands for Open Source Intelligence, and it's basically the art of gathering information from publicly available sources. This means any data that can be accessed without breaking any laws or hacking into systems. Think social media, public databases, websites, you name it. For instance, social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn are treasure troves of information. Public databases such as government records or academic publications also offer a wealth of data. Websites, blogs and forums can provide insights into various topics and trends. It might sound simple, but trust me, OSINT is crazy powerful. The ability to gather and analyze this information can reveal patterns, connections and insights that are not immediately obvious. In the world of ethical hacking, OSINT is all about using these tools to legally and ethically gather information that can help secure systems and prevent cyber attacks. Ethical hackers use OSINT to identify vulnerabilities, understand potential threats and develop strategies to protect against them. By leveraging publicly available information, they can stay one step ahead of malicious actors and ensure the safety and security of digital environments. So, whether you're a cybersecurity professional, a researcher, or just someone interested in the field, understanding OSINT is crucial. It empowers you to make informed decisions, uncover hidden details, and ultimately contribute to a safer digital world. Stay tuned as we dive deeper into the tools and techniques that make OSINT such a valuable asset in today's interconnected landscape. Now you might be wondering, where do these OSINT tools live? Well, a lot of them are bundled together in an operating system called Kali Linux. Kali Linux is like the ultimate toolkit for cybersecurity professionals and ethical hackers. It comes preloaded with a ton of tools for penetration testing, security auditing, and of course, OSINT. Think of it as your one-stop shop for all things cybersecurity. First up, we have Maltego. And let me tell you, this tool is a game changer. Maltego is all about making connections. It lets you visually map out relationships between people, companies, websites, and even IP addresses. Imagine you're trying to track down the source of a phishing attack. Maltego can help you connect the dots between fake email addresses, suspicious websites, and potentially even the attacker's real identity. Next, we have the Harvester, and this tool is all about gathering information. Lots of it. We're talking email addresses, usernames, subdomains, and more. The Harvester is like your own personal information reaper, scouring the web for any data related to your target. Now let's talk about Shodan. Shodan is like the Google of the Internet of Things. It scans the Internet for devices connected to the Internet, from webcams to industrial control systems. What makes Shodan so powerful is that it can uncover devices that are misconfigured or even completely unprotected. For security researchers, this is invaluable information that can help make the internet a safer place. 
Reconang is a web reconnaissance framework that is incredibly powerful and customizable. It's like a toolbox full of modules that you can use to gather information about your target. Need to find email addresses? There's a module for that. Want to discover subdomains? Reconang has got you covered. Chapter 7 Spiderfoot Automating Your OSINT Workflow Spiderfoot is all about automation. It takes the manual work out of OSINT by automatically gathering information from a variety of sources. You give Spiderfoot a target, like a domain name or an email address, and it does the rest. It's like having your own personal OSINT assistant working tirelessly in the background. Chapter 8 Senses Unveiling the Internet's Infrastructure Senses is like Shodan's sophisticated cousin. It's a search engine that gives you a deep dive into the Internet's infrastructure. We're talking about servers, ports, protocols, the nuts and bolts of the Internet. This is incredibly valuable information for security researchers and anyone who wants to understand how the Internet really works. Chapter 9. FOCA. Unmasking Metadata Secrets. FOCA stands for fingerprinting organizations with collected archives. It's a tool that specializes in extracting metadata from documents. Metadata is like the digital fingerprint of a file, revealing information about its author, creation date, and even the software used to create it. For investigators and security analysts, this can be a gold mine of information. Chapter 10, MetaGoofle, Google Hacking Made Easy. MetaGoofle is all about leveraging the power of Google for information gathering. It uses Google search operators, also known as Google Dorks, to find sensitive information that's been accidentally exposed online. Think things like password lists, confidential documents, or even website vulnerabilities. OSINT Framework, your OSINT Swiss Army Knife. The OSINT Framework is like the Swiss Army Knife of OSINT tools. It's a web application that provides a massive collection of resources and tools for conducting OSINT investigations. Whether you're looking for social media analysis tools, dark web resources or anything in between, the OSINT framework has got you covered. Last but not least, we have Google Dorks. These aren't a tool in the traditional sense, but they're incredibly powerful techniques for finding information using Google. By using specific search operators, you can refine your searches and uncover hidden information that wouldn't show up in a regular Google search. Stay safe, stay informed. In today's digital age, cybersecurity is more important than ever. With the increasing number of cyber threats, it's crucial to stay updated and informed about the latest tools and techniques to protect yourself and your data. That's it for our countdown of the top 10 or SYNT tools in Kali Linux for 2024. These tools are essential for anyone looking to delve into the world of open source intelligence. Whether you're a beginner or a seasoned professional, these tools can help you gather and analyze data effectively. Remember, these tools are incredibly powerful and it's important to use them ethically and responsibly. Misusing these tools can lead to serious consequences, both legally and morally. Always ensure that you have the proper authorization before using any of these tools on a network or system. If you're interested in learning more about ethical hacking and cybersecurity, be sure to check out the resources in the description below. We've compiled a list of books, courses and websites that can help you expand your knowledge and skills in this field. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content on ethical hacking and cybersecurity. Your support helps us create more valuable content and reach a wider audience. Feel free to leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. See you in the next video. Until then, stay curious, stay safe and keep exploring the fascinating world of cybersecurity. Goodbye.